welcome to my youtube channel if you're new here my name is nina so for today's video is going to be about mermaid makeup tutorial so since we are getting closer to halloween and it's october already so i'm going to do a halloween makeup tutorial every week so by the way guys expect retakes and also shout out to the people that had commented on my last week's vlogs so if you want me to do a shout out of your name so just watch this video and also comment down below so if you guys like this video please thumbs up and also subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet and hit that bell button to get notified on my latest videos so without further ado let's start the video I had already prepped my face so now I'm just going to tie my hair to get ready for makeup. Next, let's put our green contact lens. Then next, I'm just going to use my concealer to use it as a primer for my eyeshadow. Then for my primer, I'm going to use the Smashbox Photo Finish Smooth Blur Primer. So just to hide that dark circles under my eyes, so I'm going to use the lightest shade of my concealer and this is from L'Oreal Paris True Match. Then to prevent eyeshadow fall off, I'm going to use my loose powder from NYX, Can't Stop, Won't Stop. Then for my eyeshadow, I'm going to use this MAC eyeshadow in the shade green. So next eyeshadow I'm using is this Revolution Makeup London and I'm going to use the shade Cool. Then next eyeshadow I'm going to use is this 88 Ultra Shimmer Palette. Next, I'm going to use this darker blue shade on my lower eyelids. For the corners of my eyes, I'm going to apply this lighter blue shade. Next, I'm using a black eyeliner. You can use any eyeliner you have. I'm using the one from H&M. Then, I'm also going to apply it on my upper eyelids close to my lashes. So now it's time to smudge it. So I'm just smudging and blending it with the eyeshadow that I have on my eyes. Next, let's proceed to our eyebrows. And what I'm using here is a black shade from my eyeshadow palette.
Then next, I'm just brushing off the setting powder that I applied previously. So by the way guys, since I don't have foundation, so I'm just going to improvise it and use my lightest concealer as a foundation. Here I'm using the lightest concealer I have since I don't have a foundation. In this look, you need the lightest shade of foundation you have. Then for my cheeks, I'm going to use this red hot shade to use it as my blusher. By the way guys, putting blusher is just optional. You don't need to put blusher. This is just my own preference. So I'm just going to blend these two colors and apply it on the sides of my face. Usually I use bronzer for it but now I'm going to use eyeshadow instead. Then, just to lessen the harshness of the color, I'm just using my face powder. So, I'm going to use this dark purple shade on the sides of my face to add some depth. Just keep on applying and blending the eyeshadow until you get the right amount you needed on your face. Then don't forget to apply some on the bridge of your nose. Next, I'm going to apply this shade of green on the part where I already contoured my face. Since I haven't applied scales on my face, so I'm just improvising it by blending three colors, purple, blue, and green. So next, I'm just going to apply a little concealer on my lips to act as a primer. So next, I'm going to use this shade to apply it on the corners of my lips. Guys, I don't have lipstick for this look, so I'm just improvising it by using eyeshadow. So using this purple shade, I'm just going to blend it with the blue color that I applied previously. So now it's time to curl my lashes. For my mascara, I'm using Bad Girl Bang from Benefit. Now we're done with the makeup and let's proceed to our hair. 
so now I'm just going to take some parts of my hair in the front of my face and then I'm going to curl it with the curling iron and part it like this then I'm going to use this echo curl and wave gel so next I'm just going to apply this all over that hair that we have curled previously and make a loop and make sure that it sticks on your face like this then next I'm going to use these rhinestones over my eyebrows what I'm using here is this lash adhesive to act as a glue for the rhinestones For highlighter, I'm using the Zoeva Illuminating Brush. Next, I'm using my fingers to blend this on my skin. So now we're done and this is the finished look. For my gratitude to people who watched and supported me, here's a shout out to you guys. So here are the shout out to the people that commented on my last week's vlog. So first is Atikola, Maris 7 TV, Bell Austria, Bisaya in Korea, Joanna P, Puva SMR Puva, Adventures TV, Katrina Ka, Jules TV, Chris Lani Reyes, Yas Vlogs, Diora Ayanko, Thalia Reyes, and Richard Aboyme. And then special thanks to Isai Dale, Adventures TV, The Fatch Fam, Noemi My Back, Super Indai, Super Indai Channel, sorry. And Aeson Takes, Maris 07 TV, Golfer Buddy Bambi, RG Vlogs, Tito Noise Vlog, sorry. <laughs> Ethan Flynn Moments, Yaaini, The 3RS Fam, May London TV, Family B Fan, C Khan, Family Side Trip, Gladys Ann, Darlene, Richard, Marvin, Helena Hag, Julia Licken, and Edlin. So if you guys want me to do a shout out on your name, so just watch this video and comment down below. So until next time, I'll see you. Bye! So if you want... So if you... So here... So... So if you guys want me to do a shout out oh bleh. So here is the So here is the shout out for last week's vlogs and um yeah for next week's vlog yes I'm going to do a Halloween looks so if you guys mermaid looks since it's starting since October already um since it already since October already started so since we started October or so if you guys want me to do a shadow so if you guys Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. So, um, what more? Um, by the way, guys.
ska du inte missa vilken färg du tar. Victoria, you're talking to me while I'm doing this. Thank you.